I just touched down and I'm really excited to spend the day finding out what are the best things about this city. So follow me around as I talk to locals and visit restaurants and shops and big landmarks to show you why you should come visit Cincinnati. Cincinnati, also known as the Queen City, is located in southwest Ohio, right along the Ohio River. It has a really great culture, including the very first baseball team, the Cincinnati Reds. It also has a lot of great architecture and a diverse culture, which stemmed from German heritage. So I just landed in Cincinnati. What do you recommend for your breakfast to start off the day? We should go to Food Tower and go to Hathaway's. It's been around forever. And then afterwards, when I go back to work in Chiquita headquarters, you can check out Finley Market. Okay, that sounds great. Let's awesome. go. Okay. We drove from the airport to downtown Cincinnati and went to the Crew Tower, which until recently was the tallest building in Cincinnati. Hathaway's is a diner that is original to Crew Tower with a fun 50s vibe. After breakfast, I visited the Contemporary Art Center, which was designed by the famous architect Zaha Hadid. While there, I saw an exhibit about Ross and Crow, myth of the American motorcycle. While downtown, I walked around the park outside P&G headquarters and met another local Cincinnatian. Hi! Hello! You work at P&G? Yes, the headquarters is here in Cincinnati. Are you from here? I'm not. I'm just visiting for the dead. Someone told me to go check out Finley Market. You should. I'm on my way there, so we can go there and meet at Skyline. Have you ever heard of Skyline? No! That's the, like, the best fast food restaurant in Cincinnati, so we should go and check it out. Okay, sounds great. Let's go. Finley Market is Ohio's oldest public market. It's located just minutes from downtown and is a great gathering place for people from all over the city. The market hosts local farmers and vendors, street performers, and other special events. Next, we went to Skyline for lunch and ordered their famous cheese cookies. Mm. <laughs> <It's big in. laughs> I wanted to venture out of downtown, so I caught a bus to Hyde Park and met a friendly University of Cincinnati student along the way. He showed me the Blue Manatee Bookstore, which is just one of hundreds of one-of-a-kind shops and restaurants in the area. We stopped by Boca, a great local Italian place, then went to get coffee at Coffee Emporium. Well, would you like to see an interesting building unique to Cincinnati? Yeah, the mushroom house is right across the street. Okay, let's go check it out. So here's an interesting piece of architecture in Cincinnati. It's called the Mushroom House. Northside is a great late night destination. It's full of taverns and great places to find cheap food. A few of my new Cincinnati friends and I enjoyed a drink at Northside Tavern. So I've had a really fun day in Cincinnati, learning some of the best things there are to do. If you get a chance, definitely come visit. We'll see you next week on One Day in Chicago.